Stevenson gets the 68-66 win over Gettysburg tonight. Glenn Clark with head coach Gary Stewart. Coach, um, your team had to battle back in the first half, then had to withstand some blows in the second half. What did you learn about your group through all of the ups and downs this evening? Well, from a coaching perspective, it's exactly what you wanted. We got down by double figures, so we're going to learn our, a little bit about our group because we've uh, been kind of like a roadrunner deal in the first uh, two wins here. Um, to our credit, we closed it in the, in the first half to make it a one-possession game. And then in the second half, we had uh, uh, to make up for Ryan, who, who was sick tonight. Uh, we didn't have Ron. Uh, we go to Zach, who's our best shooter. And, and um, you know, he played lights out. He's a plus 16 in the minutes that he played on the floor. So we turned a 10-point deficit to a 14-point lead. Um, and then um, we didn't do um, what we needed to do, but credit Gettysburg. You know, they, they made some big threes, and I thought the contested threes. Now, we didn't uh, guard the ball as well as we should have at the end, but then uh, the last uh, four seconds we executed perfectly, got the foul that we wanted, uh, got a big block out. So that, all in all, a good night for the Mustangs. A couple of things that jumped out at me. You brought up Zach, who I thought was great. I Mikhail, I want to talk about him because he's been through a lot, obviously. We know how good of a player he is. He went 11 for 11 from the free throw line tonight, which is almost unheard of, um, including some really big ones. How good is it to have him back on at 100% and playing like we know Mikhail Williams is capable of playing? Uh, I, I can't put it into words. You know, he's a kid that uh, uh, is a 4.0 student. Um, he's. Uh, He's so consistent, you know, the effort every day, day in and day out. It doesn't matter if it's October, November, uh, um, if it's February, you know what you're getting from him. And, uh, and, and that kind of effort and concentration and discipline, um, it permeates our program. And so it starts with him. Um, we're really, really lucky to have him uh, for fifth year. Uh, but you can see what we were missing last year without him. Yeah, no question about it. And then not just him, but then at yeah, the end, Walsh as well. The four free throws with the game on the line. Um, I, I, how invaluable is that to have guys be put in those situations that are so huge, show that they can come through for you? How much does that carry on as the season goes on? Well, again, Glenn, you're talking about another fifth-year senior. You're talking about an honor student. Um, so late in the game, it's very comforting uh, because they're talented kids, uh, Mikel and, and Connor, but they're also – um, extremely cerebral, so they're thinking the game, um, and then they're really, really tough-minded. And so, um, from a coaching perspective, whether we've got to execute offensively or we've got to get a big stop, you want those type of kids on the floor. And uh, tonight, Connor stood uh, stood his ground, and, and Mikhail as well at the free throw line. We go as a team with 25 of 27, I think, from the line, and we needed every single one of them. No doubt. And then the other thing I got to point out, KJ Holton's 5'11. How about that block at the end of the first half? Man, that was awesome. Yeah, that was a big time play. Um, uh, people don't know this about KJ, but we've got some kids that really can elevate. Uh, nobody um, um, would. Oh, KJ doesn't take a back seat to any of them in terms of getting up off the floor in high school. He gets here and uh, he's laying the ball in, and I'm thinking, KJ, you used to dunk those. And he tells me he's an old man now, but uh, but what an athletic play! And and again, it's the effort to not give up on the play. You know, he he made a great play, and and again, we needed it. You know, coming down the stretch. Coach, great win tonight. Uh, good luck on the road on Saturday. Happy Thanksgiving. We'll see you back here in about ten days. All right. Same to you, Glenn. Thank you. Coach Gary Stewart, I'm Glenn Clark. Go Mustang Sports TV.